All right, so this is uh, something really, really cool we want to talk about uh, this morning. The Des Moines Gay Men's Chorus is partnering with the renowned San Francisco Gay Men's Chorus for a free concert next week. So with me this morning, Eric Shepard, who is the artistic director for the Des Moines Gay Men's Chorus. Talk about how important this event is, how monumental it is for you guys. Well, with everything going on in our state right now, uh, Jacob and I were chatting about his effort to bring love to this, yeah. this concert season. And so it's one thing that we do as we continue to ignite hearts and move minds. And so it was a perfect, perfect pairing yeah. as both choruses head up to Minneapolis late next week for an international gala festival uh, that happens every four years. And so this is the tail end of their All You Need Is Love tour. And we're coming together to sing a concert called All You Need Is Love and Music. Yeah. And uh, where is it going to be at? Oh, you know, this little spot downtown near uh, Waterworks Park called the Lordson Amphitheater. <laughs> so it'll be open to everyone. Come one, come all. Bring your, yeah. your, your little picnic basket, your blankets, your lawn chairs, and enjoy an amazing night of, of stunning music. Yeah, and this is, uh, from my understanding, the first time you guys have partnered with the San Francisco Choir. Uh, how cool is that for you guys to be able oh. to do that? To take the stage with what will be a portion of their chorus. Yeah will be unlike this chorus has ever experienced before. For our DMGMC chorus, the San Francisco Gay Men's Chorus, we'll have more than 200 singers on that stage. Yeah. So folks have never seen a choral concert like this in the city of Des Moines is, is kind of what we're thinking. And, and really, San Francisco has been at the forefront all the way since the late 70s in making sure that the choral movement uh, moves yeah. forward and, and lifts up the LGBTQ community as a whole. Yeah. And for people who are going to come or who are thinking about it, what do you hope they take away from seeing you guys up there on that stage? Well, I would hope that they see a group of amazing humans lifting voices, sharing stories, and saying that we're here in Iowa, we're here to make a difference, and we're here to give back to our community. Um, we're in for tears and joy, yeah. small group, large group, combine songs together, and it'll be a, a night to remember for sure. Yeah. For you, what does it mean to you to see the community come out and just show you guys some love and support? I will tell you for me personally, it means that all the work that we've done as singers to refine our craft um, and give back to the community, it's our way to say it's all worth that, yeah. knowing that the mission we set out to do um, is really resonating with our community, for yeah. sure. Okay, so uh, leading up to that, you know, yeah. we're, we're a couple days out. Uh, how are you feeling? A little anxious, I'll be honest. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Uh, it's a big week next week for us. Yeah. I mean, uh, as we do this concert, we're thinking all the things behind the scenes, even up to what's the catering menu. Yeah. Um, but being able to welcome and host the San Francisco Gay Men's Chorus right here in Des Moines is such an amazing historic uh, moment. And then heading up north with them and literally road tripping up to Minneapolis yeah. to join uh, over 120 other courses for a total of 7,000 LGBTQ plus singers up there in the middle of Minneapolis. It's going to be a week to remember for all of us. And I'm sure we'll need a few days of sleep yeah. uh, following that. But that's going to be a whole other problem. <laughs> that is so exciting. All right, so July July 9th. 9th. And yeah. what time does it kick off? 730. So join, you join us early, get your spot, mark your territory, and uh, enjoy time with friends. Awesome. Well, Thank you so much for uh, being here Thanks with us for today. Thanks for having us. It's yeah. been great. All right, we'll cross